Welcome back to Tennis Talk. My name's Cam Williams, and we have Indian Wells just around the corner. A massive tournament for both the men and the women. It's going to be a combined tournament. It's an ATP 1000 and a WTA 1000 for the men and the women. We have some big names that are pulling out of this event. Some big Grand Slam champions and some former champions of this event. Let's go check it out. So starting with the players that are pulled out from the WTA, we have Alexandrova. She's pulled out. The Australian Open finalist, Jen Brady. She's also pulled out. Cons has pulled out. Naomi Osaka has pulled out. Now, I don't know if we're going to see Osaka at all for the rest of the year. She did say after losing at the US Open that she was going to take some time away, so not surprised that she's pulled out. Serena Williams, she's also pulled out of this event. And Ash Barty, the world number one, the latest to pull out of this event, and that's really, really significant because she has concerns about playing in Mexico at the WTA Finals. She's not happy that they've been changed, and pulling out of Indian Wells, that might be a big indicator that she might not even play the WTA Finals. Let's hope that's not the case. She has pulled out of Indian Wells. Let's head over to the men that are pulled out of Indian Wells. And again, we've got some big names that are out of this one. Starting with Bedene, he's pulled out. Bublik has also pulled out. Chorich, also pulled out. Roger Federer, we all know that he's not playing for the rest of the year, so he's obviously pulled out of this event. Goffin has also pulled out. Mbear, Rafa Nadal, he is also out of this event again, just like Federer, not playing for the rest of the year. And Dominic Team, the defending champion, has also pulled out of this event. So Federer, Nadal, and Team, who all played really well at Indian Wells in 2019, all going to lose a lot of points. So this time, in a couple of weeks, we could be seeing them drop down in the rankings, possibly a couple of those out of the top 10 in a couple of weeks' time. So a lot of points being lost due to injury from those players. So there it is, the withdrawal list for Indian Wells. Now, Indian Wells does start in a week's time, so that list could get longer. Let me know down in the comments below. Who are you most shocked about that's not playing? We obviously know that injury has played a big part in some of the players that are not playing. Of course, Federer, Nadal, team, they're not playing for the rest of the year. Osaka's pulled out. We all know why she's pulled out we'll we've heard why over the last couple of months but ash barty that is very very shocking for me that she's pulled out it's a big surprise as well it's kind of indicating that maybe she won't play the wt finals which would be such a shame because she's well and truly the best player in the world right now on the women's side so let me know down in the comments below who are you most shocked about so indian wells just around the corner we didn't get it last year we're going to get it this year but some big names are going to be missing